Hello, welcome to the weather for the week ahead from the Met Office. We are going to see a change with our weather this week. But as always, there'll be winners and losers. If you don't like the heat and humidity, then it'll be good news that it's going to be turning distinctly fresher. We haven't seen strong winds for a while and it is going to get quite blustery, especially through Thursday. And we will all, I think, see some rain. Good news for farmers and growers. But um, there'll still be some sunshine around as well. And it's a gradual process through this week. Still, for the next couple of days, it'll be a ridge of high pressure keeping things largely dry. It's as we go towards the middle and latter part of the week that we start to see the change as weather fronts coming in from the Atlantic will bring spells of rain. And look at the isobars on the chart for Thursday getting very blustery indeed. Why the change? Well, we need to look high up into the atmosphere and at the jet stream, which has been well to the north of us recently and is still well out in the Atlantic on Monday. But as we go through this week, just watch as the jet stream, that powerful ribbon of air high up, drives towards the UK. And it's that which brings us the areas of low pressure. So it's that shift in jet stream which is bringing us the change. But it's not for a few days. Still some fine weather to be had through the early part of the week. One or two thunderstorms on Monday. And then on Tuesday, again, there will be one or two scattered showers. It could be quite a cloudy day across parts of central and eastern England. That cloud tending to break up a little bit through the day. Any showers will be well scattered. And for most places, it's dry and it's fine. But it will be cooler through Tuesday compared to Monday. Temperatures, well, struggling to reach 20 Celsius. Many places in the mid to high teens. So already starting to turn a little bit fresh. And that will continue through the rest of the week. But we've got this little bump in the isobars, still a ridge of high pressure for Wednesday, which again, for most places, means it will be another dry day. And again, many places will see sunny spells. Just the likelihood of one or two showers through the day could develop through the afternoon across some central and southern parts. And we will start to see a weather front introducing thicker cloud and some rain across the northwest during the course of Wednesday. The breeze changing direction now coming in from the southwest, not especially strong at this stage, but it's that switch in direction, which means eastern areas, which have been plagued with low cloud and cool conditions for a number of weeks, will actually cheer up quite nicely. It'll feel quite a bit warmer here. Now, it's really as we go into Wednesday night and Thursday that we'll start to see a more dramatic change. This deepening area of low pressure driven on by the jet stream sweeping its way towards the UK. The isobars squeezing together. We know what that means. The winds will be picking up. So it's going to turn blustery and it's going to turn quite wet. Uh, the wet weather mostly around in the morning across England and Wales. It may well scoot through in the afternoon looking brighter, but very blustery with frequent showers across Scotland. The winds, I think, are really the big feature through Thursday. Like to see some very strong gusts across Scotland especially. Blustery everywhere with sunshine and showers. But again, it will brighten up across the south. There will be some sunshine, but it'll be the feel of the day that's really noticeable. Temperature's still in the high teens, up to 20 degrees, but it will be much fresher much less humid. Of course, that less humid air means it's uh, easier for sleeping and it'll be a fresh night on Thursday night and into Friday. And actually for Friday, it looks like we're mostly between weather systems. This one will eventually bring, bring some cloud and rain into the north and the west through the day. But for the bulk of central and eastern Britain, Friday at the moment looks dry and fine. And again, those eastern coasts looking a lot brighter than they have done for much of the past few weeks. Again, temperatures will be um, around about average for the time of year, mid to high teens, fresher than it has been, but still pleasant if you do get some sunshine. But there are further bands of showers to come in as we go towards the weekend. As always, we'll firm up more on the details for the weekend over the next few days. But at the moment, it looks like it'll be chopping and changing a bit. A brisk breeze, there'll be some sunshine and a few showers with temperatures around about average. Stay up to date with the latest and with all the changes through the Met Office website, through our app, and of course, across social media.